back to the channel and i hope you guys are doing absolutely fine first of all just simply log in with your credentials and once you're done with that in the description box of this video i will share on the github link just me click on that link and then you are able to access this file over here so just me scroll down over here and from here you can see this url so just me open this url in incognito window this will activate your cloud shell so just me wait for that And it's finally done. Now just me come back over here and from here you can see this curl command. This will download this GitHub repo from my GitHub to your cloud shell. Then we have to make this file executable. For that we have to just me run this chmod command. And for executing all this command we have to just me run this last one. So just me copy all this command like this way. Come back, paste, hit enter. Wait for a second and now here you can see zone 1. Now I request to please pay attention. Okay, for the zone 1. Come back to the lab instructions, click on the task number 1, scroll down a little bit and from here you can see from the point number 5, you can see this zone 1, ok. So this is our zone 1, so just me copy this, come back, paste, hit end, ok. Now if we just me check over here, this command zone and this command zone is same. So that's why we are calling this as a zone 1. Now for the zone 2, just simply copy this zone carefully, come back, paste, hit enter. Now for the zone 3, just simply copy this zone, copy like this, come back, paste, hit enter. And for the last zone, just simply copy this last zone over here. So just simply copy like this way, come back, paste, hit enter. Wait for a second and then just simply click on authorize. Now you have to just simply wait for this command get execute and once it's done, you are done with this lab. So just simply wait for a couple of seconds and after that we will check the score for the lab.
and it's finally done now if you just me come back over here and click on the check my progress for each and every task you will get a score without any issue and if the score is not updated for any particular task no need to worry just me wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a full score over here for sure and that's a way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys